Good morning, folks. All right, so today I am going to be taking the stock uh, TSX manifold, exhaust manifold off, and I'm going to be replacing it with this PLM Big Tube 4-2, four, 4-2 two, four, yeah, four header, I guess. I think that's what you call it. So it's a PLM header. Taking that off, replacing that. Um, a little update, I took the engine intake, the cold air, so that way I don't have to worry about like hydrolocking my engine and having it suck water and whatnot when it's right here. So I did replace it with this. Picked this arm up for 30 bucks. Uh, I just need the coupling here. Coupling, coupler, whatever, what is it called? Something like that. And a new filter, cause this obviously doesn't fit. That's about it. Let's get to it. Oh, wow. So I didn't know how to take off the whole axle and the whole, uh, what is it called? Intermediate shaft, that shaft in there. I, I don't know what it's called, I forgot. So I had to take that off, the axle off, just so I can drop the, uh, the stock header or exhaust manifold and put this PLM one on. Wow, headache. Look at my hand. Dirty. Man. Look what I came home to. Oh, yeah. Overnight parts from Japan. All right, let's open this up now. Let's see what we got. Let's go. Damn. Oh, gotta cut that. Oh, man. Put it on the table. Let's turn it the other way. Get some better lighting. Oh, look at that bling. Oh, man. Come on. Boy. Ooh, the bling, though. So I did end up uh, ordering the whole cat back. Well, I'm just leaving it in there. It's just black. Yeah. Damn, look at that. That's clean. So shout out to uh, Christian, man, from Honda Vlogs. Thanks, Christian. Uh, he hooked it up. Went to his shop. And, uh... Hooked your boy up. Yo, thank you. So I got it laid out. Um, I'm not going to unwrap that until I take it back to my car and get it installed. I didn't think this was going to be black. So I was under the assumption that uh, 
it's gonna be polished as well but I actually like it black it looks I think it's better I guess not so flashy even though this is really flashy so it came with the pipes that and uh, got the hardware gasket yeah I like it I'm you know happy with it Ooh. Dang, let's, let's see what's on that. <clears throat> okay, cool. Damn, so <clears throat> I got the muffler mocked up. Oops. Clean. I mean, I just gotta adjust the uh, the uh, hanger a little bit so that we can be like really centered. But it's not off and it ain't touching, so it should be good. So, see, I like it, and I got the the pipe under there. It's just not connected. Got my, uh, so there's no cat, nothing. Then I'll take it to a muffler shop and get a cat. But yeah. Loving the look though. Goodness. So clean. Damn, good morning. So I know this video is going to be like all over the place. Uh, so today I got to cut the hood a little more. Spread it out a little bit so that I can shut the hood and not have it scrape the... Power steering components. Good morning. Dun it. Dun it. I can't do the sharks thing, but it looks so much better without a hood. At least the bumper's on. Go ahead and finish up the hood and we'll test fit it. Dun it, dun it, dun it, dun it. Hmm. 50 minutes later and I'm done. So, wanted to take my time. So, I mean, it looks a lot cleaner than before. A lot straighter. So I just got to tape up the edges. Kind of like like all these edges. So that way um, it doesn't cut anything if it don't shut. And I'll go ahead and touch fit that. But yeah, it took me down 50 minutes. So, finally got the hood cut. Looks, this is what I meant when I said tape it. Um, so that when I shut it, if I, if it was to touch anything, it wouldn't cut anything. But yeah, it should be good. Let me go ahead and see what's up. Oh, so it doesn't touch. Oh, I can't even see it. Yeah. Barely. Damn, I haven't um, I haven't uploaded in a while, but the car's looking good. Um, it runs. I don't know. I'm bad for looking like this right now. I just woke up, but yeah, the, no, the car is good. It runs. Um, so two main things left. I need a catalytic converter, and uh, I need a register, a register and a small again. And it should be legal. No, not legal, but <laughs> it should be legal. And uh, I'll be able to, to drive it and it'll be back on the road. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Oh, yeah, and uh, I need to. I need to fix my whole intake issue. So um, I'm running that 
if, if, if you guys look through the video, you guys will see um, the AM intake. I need a Copler, Copler, Copling, little, you know what I'm talking about. So the little rubber piece from the uh, throttle bottle t throttle body to the intake, um, I need that and uh, a filter for it. If not, then I'll probably try to pick up a stock intake, uh, an R stock RSX intake, and uh, put that on. But anyways, um, yeah, ho you know, hopefully you guys enjoy this clip, uh, whatever I just put together. Just keep you guys updated. Yeah. Anyways, man, love, peace, and chicken grease. Deuce.